What up, what up, guys? It's Lopez Customs. The number one, the only, king of the hop game, suspension-wise, and you bars because the homie from SD. We back in the house from the Vegas Super Show. My bike's taped up. I'm going to get some patterns tomorrow. Do my airbrush work. But we're here today looking at uh, maybe like a little, say, progress on this car specifically since I've been waiting to get my A arms back which I've officially gotten back they were supposed to be casted caster lagged on it what can I do so I just asked for them back and got them back so that's how it works as you may know most of you or some of you who are in Lalo I left the group I left True Riders group and I also left LUGK group why? Because I'm no longer part of LUGK. My reasons being, I'm not going to be listed. What well, for? I have no, no reason to tell you guys my personal business. Let's just say I didn't like what it was turning into. And what it was turning into wasn't becoming what it was first at. And what it was better at what it was first at. But back to the ha matter at hand. I'm cool with most of the members. Or a couple of the members. Actually, the original members are the ones I'm cool with. New ones... Not so much. Only maybe one or two. I'm talking about all original members as in when I was in it. Original members. When I first started. Original members. So. Clarifying what I said. I'm um, here with the 60. Got the leafing. Whatever. You know. The patterns. This has been painted for a while. I just haven't had time to get around to it. Like I said. The ARs were holding me back. So God, I just painted these. I gotta go around and touch up some of the little flaw I put into it, you know, into the spokes or whatever, some of the white wall and shit, full four ink set up, locked up right now, it lays all the way to the floor, the arms are tucked out, lift the door, black wants to grill, I put most of the chromes on, I'll put the, you know, glasses on, and I got, um, let's bring out Switchman's Cutlass, here I got another customer's car, but the customer said not to show the vehicle, so I'm gonna just do as it do as told. Switchman's Cuddy, we got you know hero lights, orange out, corner light too, each corner light, got the flat red lights, make a more realistic look to it. Custom cut sunroof, see how it's got some of the dents in there. That's you know, still got paint to go. Got the full chrome suspension molded up, all custom, Lopez Customs made. Uh, well, chrome cross member or engine cross member is yes. full four link. I will be making it function. It's kind of crooked as of right now, as you can see. It's really off. I can pop it back into place, so it's just no big deal. I mean, I'm gonna pop that shit back into place once I hinge it. Yeah, it's for so it's just like his real lockup. It's kind of loose. I'll here and pop the hood for you guys. That's what I'm trying to do. This is a resin, pain in the ass, but I had to shave down to make it fit correctly. It was cool though. It's cool. I don't plan on doing another colors anytime soon. The Euro grill, custom photo edge grills. You don't buy these, you make them. And then I got the Monte Carlo. I cut up the firewall out of the Monte Carlo, the whole bridge, molded it in, did a flat firewall because like the hoppers have the flat firewalls, full custom four, uh, four, full custom six piece A-arms, I will be making and selling A-arms for about 30 bucks a set, just uppers, what they hinge, and everything, spindles there, you know, your spring there, or whatever, it's all free movement more or less, so you can see your hinge fell off. You know, I got my Malibu. Is with the homie still. He's still getting around to it. He's a little sick and down. But um, this is pretty much what I've had at the shop so far. I've been gone for a while. Took a little two week vacation. Came back from Vegas from what yesterday, day before yesterday, Monday. Yeah, Monday is when I came back from Vegas and I've been wanting to do shit since. But now I'm back in action. I'm gonna finish this one first. Then hopefully. This one and the other other customer's car. And then I also have this Monte Carlo right here. 
they have to use the parts for this. I'm using the engine and stuff, but the body and the undercarriage and uh, suspension, I will be doing molded up and lifted on servos or whatever. And I'll be selling it for about 200 to 180 switch box ready to go. And I got a 59 brand new kit over there. That will be for sale. All it's going to be missing, all it's missing is a fifth wheel and the fifth wheel bumper that goes on the back. It's all it's missing. Give me 30 bucks plus shipping because shipping's rising more and more. Um, yeah, that's pretty much what's going down over here. Got the two door big body for over here still getting worked on. I got this one for sale too. It's not, it's a custom painted, uh, Lindbergh. I painted a while back. Full patterned or whatever, you know, it's clean, flaked out as you can see. The flakes are dancing. <laughs> it's got a nick and chip right here, but I'll let it go for about 65 bucks. 60 bucks. It's got a facelift with the new newer rims. 